Hey, it's me, Substitute. Happy Holidays, everyone. For this fake mon not Friday episode, I thought I'd give narrating these videos a try for once. A few of you have asked for it, and I'm happy to oblige. So here's what I'm thinking. I'll try alternating between explaining what I'm doing on screen and giving a fun fact or two about the fake mon in question. I'm still figuring out the format, so please let me know what works and what doesn't, okay? Okay. Narcical. For drawing, my current drawing program is GIMP, which is a free Photoshop alternative. I use the paintbrush tool and set it to 0.75 hardness and 4 pixels in size. That's the rough estimate I have for Sugimori style, but it doesn't always work for me. If anyone else has better estimates, correct me, please. Fun fact time! It was originally inspired by Team Rocket's submarines and the Nautilus from 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. It was a steel water type before being changed to steel ice. For the outline, I first make the sketch opaque. I then trace over it carefully with a new layer using the same brush settings. It's okay if it's a bit squiggly, if you're going for the Gen 1 uh, rustic look. Ooh, fun fact time again. The snow-like patterns on it are supposed to resemble rust or barnacles that form on ships. I use the path tool to trace around the perimeter of my drawing. This will help ease the coloring process later on, so I don't have to worry about coloring inside the lines. You simply put these dots along the edges and close them off once you loop back around. Use the select from path option. Base color is pretty simple. You add a new layer for each color you use, so long as the outline remains on top. The selected path thing you've done earlier should still be in effect, so you don't have to worry about staying in the lines, as I said before. Fun fact time again. This latest version of Narzical somehow ended up looking like Grounder from the old Sonic cartoon. I don't know how, it just happened.
This is a key step in achieving some semblance of Sugi style art. I used an acrylic 04 brush size 25 to paint in the white highlight. It's a bit arbitrary where I put the splotches. Lighting can oftentimes come from both sides in these kind of drawings, so I get pretty generous with it. White splotches. White splotches everywhere. I then use a semi-transparent intermediate color to blend in the white with the base color. The smudging tool helps too. Are you ready for the final fun fact? Narsicle is the signature Pokemon of an Elite Four member. Its gimmick strategy is using Lock-On, Sheer Cold, and Horn Drip. Good luck you Nuzlockers. You'll need it. And... we're pretty much done.